everyone and welcome back to another CC video and today we're going to be looking at custom content stove packs. So today we're going to be starting with this amazing pack by Harry and Felix Andre Sims and it's called Tiny Travelers. It's a jungle or safari themed toddler pack and it's actually the first of free sets by these creators that I'll review. So this is the first part and then there's two other ones which come in a different video but this is just focused on this very cute toddler pack. So if you want to see me vent about all these little cute objects that you just saw, keep watching. Alright, let's get started. Uh, I just want to say I got the unmerged version of this pack, which basically means that all the items are separate little files. So if I don't like an item, I can just throw it out. And I'll kind of let you know if I'm not planning on keeping an item and why. Just because, you know, sometimes that's interesting. <laughs> I don't even know. Alright, so we're starting off with an item which I'll definitely keep, which is this cute mattress. And I really like it because it comes in some pattern swatches but it also comes in like these animal swatches oh yes i wanted to show you the zebra because i thought it was such a cute zebra okay so um it comes in this like very typical thing of like uh giving you the mattress and then giving you a separate bed frame so they don't have to make a billion thousand swatches for everyone but you can like mix and match with the bed frames you know so we're going to look at the bat frames later, um, but we also get these in solid swatches, which is just um, some matching colors to those, and they're all in this like very toned down, earthy safari tones, which I'm not mad about, it's just I wish we had more vibrant colors since it is a kid's room, but then again we have so much vibrant kid stuff <laughs> um, that it's not too bad. Okay, next item that we have is this poof thing, which comes in, like, matching swatches for these. Uh, I'm, I actually don't think I'll be keeping this. This is the first time that I'm like, I don't think I'll be keeping it. It's cute, but, I mean, well, maybe if you kind of miss and make, <laughs> I can't talk, mix and match them, that could be cute. I don't even know. So this is definitely not my favorite item, because it's just... I don't really see myself using it. Next item, though, is really amazing, which is this swing. And it's actually a chair. Like, it is in a chair category. It does not say that, but it is. Um, it comes in different heights for different wall heights as well. So, basically, what you would do is you would put this in your kid's room, and it would look like they have a swing set in their house, but it's actually just a chair. Um, either way, that's really adorable. I really love this. <laughs> And again, with the texture, or not really again, but with the texture, it looks like something that EA would make, which is so beautiful about these packs. So that's really nice. Um, next thing is this little chair, which kind of looks like like a movie set chair. Like it would have a name here, right? But it's supposed to be like a camping or archaeology or whatever chair. Not my favorite, but but it's so well made. Like, look at those details. Hell yeah. Um, next thing is something I don't like. <laughs> Not that I don't like the idea, and obviously it's amazingly well made, but this I don't see myself using just because it doesn't look like something that a normal person would have. Like, it looks almost as if someone made him made it themselves, you know? Um, which I'm not really about. I love the idea with this, like, branch thing. And you will see other things in this pack that do have this little branch idea to it. But, yeah, I'm not a fan of this chair, particularly. But it's very well made. Then we have this, like, table or bench. I'm not even sure. It's an ottoman. <laughs> okay, I think they can sit on it. I'm not sure. Um... And it comes in, like, matching swatches again. It's not my favorite item, but it's not, like, this chair either. <laughs> so, this is alright. I don't really see much use of it, but alright. Then we have the bat frames, which I feel like I'm pointing out so many things I don't like right now. But I promise you, most of the things that will come, I will like. It's just that a lot of things that I don't like just come after each other. So... This bat frame just doesn't sit right with me. I don't know what it is. It's just 
it's just not my type of bed frame. <laughs> anyway, so it comes in a toddler size as well, which is cute. And then this bed frame. Oh my god, we have to move the swing. Um, this bed frame. I'm not even kidding. This should have come with uh, Island Paradise, Island Living, not Island Paradise, <laughs> Island Living or Jungle Adventures. Look at it. It's just so jungly. I, I don't even see myself using this, but I'm still so excited that we got this. Just because it's, it's so nice and it kind of, it frames it so nicely. Oh my god, I really like it. Next item I am so pumped about because... Well, this is like a changing table, first of all. And this swatch is my favorite swatch. I, I don't even have to look at the others. <laughs> this swatch is so nice. And also, can we talk about how toddler rooms, like everything for toddlers, is just so close to the floor. And they just look so empty at like the the lower, at uh, the upper part of the room just looks so empty. So... To ha actually have a piece of furniture that is higher than most of the toddler furniture, I'm so excited for. And it just makes sense for a toddler room as well. Because it's a changing table. Which, unfortunately, we don't need anymore. I really like changing tables in The Sims too, but whatever. <laughs> so the next item is adorable. Because look at those little animal stickers. How cute is that? Then there's some solid ones, but the animal sticker ones, especially the fox one, is just beyond cute and beautiful and amazing and i love it okay next thing i don't love because <laughs> this chair uh well it's not a chair it's a table this table what is it i don't know it looks like an ikea cheap toddler table but then it has this branch situation to it but this really not supernatural looking top i don't like it okay i just i don't <laughs> but i really like this this is a desk and it kind of is like the archaeology table, I think. I don't really know. I don't use the archaeology table that often. But it's really nice. And I like this idea that you could technically, like, make it smaller. But you don't. Like, it's not an option to do that. But you could make it smaller, you know. Um, really like it. It's such a cool idea. Um, and yeah, I see myself using this, definitely. Not really in a toddler room, though. But <laughs> I'll definitely use it. Okay, next thing is hanging on the wall, and this is really cute, and I, I wish it would come in a version without the hat, because that would make it so much more versatile. Anyway, I like it, and I'm still debating on keeping it, even though it's so very, very only usable with this type of content, with this hat, you know? But then again, I really love the idea of, like, your toddler has this, like tropical helmet for their adventures i don't know i think it's really cute and this plant looks amazing too so then we have one of my favorite items look at this i could talk about this for hours this swatch is not only educational it's also aesthetically pleasing like this is such a nice thing um and you could use this like like I, it's just so amazing. I just really love it. And it just, it's so adorable. And just, it really fits, like, with the theme of the pack. And it just, oh, it's just so beautiful. I can't even put into words how much I love this map thing. Um, then we do have pictures which are not really, like, toddlerish, But I guess they make sense with the whole traveling theme. Um, wait... This is actually my favorite swatch. I don't even know why <laughs> it just is. And this is so well made. Look at how, you know, presumably there would be a glass panel in front of this picture. And it actually shows the light reflections and stuff. And that's just one of those details that makes this so well made. Um, then we have this, which is kind of minimalistic paintings of animals. And I wish they would come in swatches where, you know, each animal be available with each frame, if that makes sense. Because now if I wanted, like, this jaguar and then this wolf, I couldn't, like, that would look stupid, you know? Um... So that's kind of sad, but it's still a nice little thing. And I love that it hangs from this, like... Tie thing because 
usually, you know, we don't really have this. And, like, with this, you already see, like, different ways of having it mounted to the wall, which is nice. And it's, like, these little details, it just... Oh, I love it, man. And <laughs> then we have a... This is so nice. Um, because not only, like, this is, this could give you, like, forest vibes and, like, oh, little cute little toddler room. But also, if you put it in, like, one of the darker swatches, this looks like a designer piece. Like, something that you would pay a lot of money for. And I like that. I just, I think this is more versatile than what you might think first. So, yeah. I'm, I'm excited to use this, definitely. Next thing, we have this which is I think just decoration but look at it it's so cute it's a little bear and I can totally see myself decorating with this like you can never have enough decorative toys because cute stuff is cute <laughs> what then we have this little like play tent I think it's a play tent and I think it's supposed to kind of remind you of like a mosquito tent um amazing I just love it and it comes with different wall height uh, situations as well but I mean put a little play set in here oh so cute and then we have these oh wait this is not a shelf this is oh right this is actually for the changing table and this is one of those items which are the main reason that I'm never getting sets or packs as a merged file because I want to throw this out I mean, it belongs in here, but I don't like stuff that has just one use. Like, I literally cannot use this for anything but this changing table. Which is so sad. Like, why? Why would you do that? <laughs> um, I don't know. That's sad. Uh, but yeah. It's, it's still nice. I'm not bashing this for the quality in any sort of way. The quality of everything here is incredible. Um... Then we have this, which is just decoration, and it's not really toddlery, but look at it. And then again, look at it again, because it even has like a lens effect here on this little... What? This is so, so well made, and I love it. <laughs> um, then we have this helmet again, and it comes in surprisingly colorful swatches, I realized. I don't know why you would have this but it's there um and those the bunnies are kind of a oop, that's not what i wanted to do the bunnies are kind of like a common theme in the sims and i never really understood them but i also never really questioned them which is kind of probably what they're there for uh but yeah we, we now have them as like plushies i guess um and it comes some swatches nice okay then this might be my favorite items from the entire pack. It's a little crocodile and it looks so goofy. And I just saw this in a preview picture and I was like, I'm going to get this pack because look at it. It's adorable. And then this swatch looks just all over the place and I love it. And this is a tiger swatch and a crocodile. I'm just, I'm, I'm living for this. This is actually really cute, but this might be my favorite because it's just so trippy. <laughs> okay, I just kind of want to build a toddler room just with this crocodile. Or like a mansion for this. Okay, I'm, I'm really going crazy here. Okay, then this picture, I'm going to pull it over. Also comes in a leaning swatch, which I love. Or not a swatch, uh, a mesh. Which, oh my god, is amazing. Because we don't have enough leaning pictures like this. And they're actually really stylish. So, yeah, there's that. Then we have these binoculars. I can never remember what those things are called. But they're binoculars. Again, this is one of those items that I don't think I'll be using ever. Like, in what situation would you need binoculars <laughs> ever? Like, this is one of those items that I'll delete, even though they're really cool, but I just know I won't be using them. Like, in your everyday gameplay, how much do you, how often do you think, like, oh, man, I wish I had some binoculars to direct, de <laughs> to decorate? And then we have this carpet, which I do not like. It's way too, like, not stylish and colorful. Like, this might be okay, because it's kind of like a play carpet, but yeah, not my favorite item. Then we have this wall decor which is like a f f stuffy flamingo thing actually my best friend 
I'm a, I'm a go on a story time here. My best friend has one of those, but it's a goat. And it's like a plushy goat, and it's really amazing. Um, but yeah, I don't really know if I'll be using this, but it's definitely cute. Then we have those, which are questionable. I mean, I don't know why. Alright. Then we have a decorative barcinet, and it c later has a different barcinet that you can actually use for a baby. But this is just decorative for some reason. Let me put it here in the play tent. Look at it. Isn't that cute? I think it is. Alright, so this item <sighs> is amazing. It's a little tent to put over the bed. How cozy is that? It's like camping, but with the comfort of your bed. <laughs> and it comes in a taller size as well. It's just so nice. I mean, I could even like if you're gonna be really crazy, like, sleep outside with these? Like, if you have a really rich family, just put those in, like, a... On, like, a... I don't even know, but you could sleep in the garden with it. I just... Oh, God, I love them so much. They're really amazing. And they come in those, like, typical colors, but a lot of them... I don't know. This is really crazy. But, oh, love it. Uh... Then we have those lamps, which I'm not too keen on because they're really giant and I just see myself, because they're ceiling lights, I just feel like you'd put them on a ceiling and they would always block your view. Like they would always be kind of in the way, almost. And look how low they're hanging. I don't even know if they're supposed to be ceiling lights, to be honest. Um, and this is the barcinet that you can actually use for a baby i don't really know what this preview shows the like actual the basic barcinet thing but if you pull it out it's this and it comes in different swatches as well again this is matching those which is cute and we don't have enough barcinets i don't know why we do not get more barcinets but we need them um so, then we have this, like, goofy giraffe decor, uh, which, I mean, more power to you. This, though, that's a shelf. That is something else. Look at it. It looks like a tree, but it also looks super modern and minimal minimalistic. <laughs> and, ooh, it's just so nice, because it's so modern and just... But so silly and childish and oh, it's just cute. Then we have these dresser and the uh, wardrobe <laughs> things. I'm not a native speaker if you couldn't tell. Um, and it's just so nice because we rarely get good CC wardrobe and drawers. And I think the reason is because there's so much more to it if you think about it. Like they have to be able to open it and that's I think a whole other level of having to make a mesh for so yeah I guess that's why but I'm so glad to keep to get new stuff like this so yeah I'm so excited to keep it and to bleh, to use it I can't speak today uh, this lamp though amazing everyone from your toddler to your grandma will love this it's it's just like really grandma-ish lamp but the stand is a dinosaur <laughs> which is just damn that's a cool looking lamp okay next thing i do not like this might be my least favorite thing of the entire pack because how the hell am i gonna use this it just does not make sense to me it looks really old and weird and I guess it's cute and it's super well made again but I don't I just I don't know how anyone would use this at all this is just yeah I don't get it so moving on to something I do get and that I will buy a lot of are toy dinosaurs and I don't think they come in different swatches no they don't and I just want to get a billion thousand of those now because they're actually even playable with like your kid can like play around with them which is 
amazing and great and yay and then we have this zebra which is one of those big animals that they can hug and talk to and stuff amazing i'm so excited to use the zebra and all my toddlers i don't know why i do this but all my toddlers get one of those big chunky stuffy animals and now i have more of them so then we have this big ass castle look at it amazing it's a play castle thing right then we have an activity table which is actually the last thing oh almost the last thing this activity table and it looks like a little archaeology table but it's actually a creative skill thing i think it's adorable look at it just you little archaeologist throwing dinosaurs and stuff that's so cute okay so and then i said we're not really done because it also comes with some wallpapers and this amazing and it comes in so many swatches and they're all amazing like this i want to use in every room now and it's just like continuous picture wall thing with the monkeys it's cute and then we have clouds and then we have these which are more modern and like minimalistic but nevertheless really amazing but this is definitely my favorite one <laughs> so we have this and then we have this dinosaur uh pattern which just comes in different swatches of dinosaurishness and it's nice oh i especially like the gray one i didn't notice this i was previously looking at this one this pack before um and i didn't notice the gray one but the gray one is like so low-key but ooh, i like it then we have this pattern which is also very amazing it's kind of just like this leaf pattern but it comes in different colors which all somewhat makes sense for the leaves i don't know i mean it's just amazing it's it's oh. I'm really running out of adjectives here. And then we also have solid swatches, which are just, you know, solid swatches of the colors that are used in this pack. Which is always nice to have because I feel like we don't get that many solid swatches from EA. Um, but yeah, they're definitely really nice. And they all come the same things with, like, wall... I think it's called decal? I don't know. Um, that... It comes with this wall trim. Okay. Uh, it comes with a wall trim. And all of these you can get with a wall trim as well. So if you're into that. Y you you can be that. <laughs> what? This concludes this amazing little CC stuff pack. Let me know what you think about it. Let me know if there's any stuff packs that you really want reviewed. Or that you think were horrible and you want me to say I'm not gonna keep any of this I don't know why you would want to watch that but if you do let me know so if you want to see the other packs by these creators definitely make sure to watch the other videos that I'm going to be making on them and yeah that's kind of all I have to say thank you so much for watching 